The Anglo-Zanzibar War is noted as history's shortest war, lasting less than 40 minutes. Hamid bin Zawainia had been Sultan of Zanzibar for four years when, at the young age of 39, he suddenly died. It's generally believed he was poisoned, possibly by his cousin Khalid bin Bargash, who quickly assumed the throne. The problem was, as far as the British were concerned, the new Sultan was pro-German rather than pro-England. Britain very nicely asked the new Sultan to step down, calling on a 30-year-old treaty that said the Sultan needed to be approved by Britain before assuming power. Khalid responded by locking himself in the palace. On August 27, 1896, four British warships parked themselves in Zanzibar Harbor and asked again. The Sultan said he would not lower his flag and did not believe that the warships would fire on them. Rear Admiral Harry Rowson, who was in charge of the small fleet, gave them 30 minutes to change their mind. From 902 to 940, the ships fired, reducing the palace to rubble. The Sultan and his men fled. More than 500 people died on the Zanzibar side, and one sailor got injured on the British side. And that was it. The war was over. 